Hello everyone, in this video I'm gonna explain all you need for exterior elevation render in materials and lighting setting and render setting to get results like this. First of all, we need to speed up the model before we work on, so go to style, edit and unmark all of these. And on the left corner, click on this logo and go to statics text and purge unused and fix problems. For all materials used in this models, I gonna briefly show you the settings for each material. Always recommend to use groups component so you can change it with one click. As you can see here, this material needs a little bit of reflection, so we're gonna add reflection from here. For landscape, also recommended to use components so you can change anything only in one, and also recommend to use Lowberg Planet. So here I use this one. And for here, I use this one, and this also the same, this one, and for all the trees used in the model, I recommend to use the first one. 
this. Download Lowerbark, just Google it. Go to home page, store. Choose the first one, the free one. Add to cart. Then check out, fill your information and purchase. For lighting, turn off the sunlight from here and use doom light. For people who don't know how to use Doom Light, just click on the Doom logo and add it in the model anywhere. Enable edges so you can see it. And here we add it and rotate it based on the arrow direction. The arrow direction means the sunlight direction. So I will make it, for example, in this direction. I will delete the new one. The one used in the model, go to for map from here and choose HDMI you will find the folder in the description I will choose this one and make it invisible if you want to add background on your own in Photoshop or you can choose the HDMI background like this we choose the background and here we can set it from here invisible and make sure from the intensity with this number for me I will hide the background also for lighting go to settings and camera and change this value to 14 and make it in light blue very light blue for elastic rental setting please follow my lead Make sure you save your image in folder in any path you want. Like this automatically when the render finish the image will save. Make sure also you have these render elements in your model and I will explain how to use it in Photoshop in another video. You will find this model free download in the description to have a render on your own. Have a nice render.